Hi, I'm Brindy Nielsen, and we'll get started with my three things. Okay, so my first item is a like piper, but it's not like a piping bag, it's just like a hand piper. Um, that describes me because I really like to cook, I really like to be in the kitchen, um, and baking is just like where I can express myself and be comfortable and like my stress reliever. Um, it helps me like branch out and meet new people because who doesn't want cookies or something when they like move into a neighborhood. Uh, my second item is a book. It's Pride and Prejudice. Um, I really love to read. Um, I like all sorts of genres. I like learning new things and um, finding out about different time periods, about different people, um, about ourselves. Like, I like psychology books, mysteries, romances, um, fantasy, realistic fiction. Um, they're all really good. My last item is Lego Batman. And this really describes me because, I mean, it's the best movie ever. It, I don't know, the characters are way good. They're like, they are realistic without like being too overbearing about it. So like they're, it's really light and fun and up and they try to keep things on the comedic side, but they also have like attributes that I think a lot of us can relate to. And then the other thing is it's hilarious and there's jokes for like not only little kids, like, oh, it's not just a little kid movie. It's for like adults. Like there's so many hidden gems in there. Oh, I love it. So in two years, um, I see myself finishing my first year at Snow. Uh, I don't know like what I want to go into yet or anything like that. I'm hoping to figure it out along the way. Um, but then I'm going to be preparing to go and serve um, a, in a church calling. Um, and hopefully I'll be able to complete that and then come back to Snow. So if I could be an actress in any TV show, I would probably pick Parks and Rec. Um, just because, like, I don't know, the characters, there's such a range of characters. And it's really funny. Like, I love it. The humor is a gem. Um, and, like, it deals with issues and it, like, teaches you things, like, in government and stuff. Um, without being, like, a documentary and, like, listing off facts. Um, that was one thing that I always thought was funny because I had a... I watched it over the summer and then I went back to school and I was in this government class and the only reason that I knew anything was because of Parks and Rec and it was so funny. Um, but I would love to be an actress in that movie. Uh, a leader that I respect would probably be Eleanor Roosevelt. We in AP History talked about her role as first lady, um, but she always had like a passion for whatever she was doing. And even though she like faced a lot of hard things in her life, she overcame them and became stronger and better and more compassionate. And those are all things that I really look up to and would like to uh, acquire for myself. What did the plumber say to the sandwich maker? I'd like mine cut into wedgies. <laughs> One of the very first things that I noticed about snow uh, one year I went down there to do a campus tour and the campus is so welcoming and it has such like a at home feeling. It's small so like I don't have to worry about getting lost um, and the class sizes are small too like the individual learning. Um, you can have a relationship with your professor, you can know the people in your classes instead of being compared to like a, a huge university where you have a hundred or more students in your class and you turn in your assignments and that's all that the relationship with your professor is. Like if you need help, you can go, you can talk to your professor. If you can't come to class one day, they'll like reach out to you. Um, and that's a very comforting thought because like your way, it's college, kind of intimidating, um, but you'll know that your professors care about you. Uh, another great thing is that your credits that you have are transferred easily. So like, I am taking um, a lot of concurrent enrollment and AP classes, and those credits can be transferred so easily over to Snow. And then when you're done with your two years, um, you can transfer your degree that you get 
to any school. Like it's so simple and the process is so nice and not complicated at all. Um, another great thing about Snow College is um, it's so cost efficient and like you don't have to worry about money. Like it's just so much nicer because you have all these colleges and you hear about how much it costs for a semester, but snow, you can like, it seems affordable. You can, you can do it no matter what station or position or how far along you are with money financially. Um, snow is like very affordable. Um, and the last thing I want to talk about is the campus life. Uh, you have on-campus dorms and housing and they have options available for everyone like they have like apartment like ones they have like house ones um whatever you need or whatever you want or in your housing they're gonna have provide options for um they also have off-campus housing um and for all i've heard about it is amazing everybody loves it um and then there's so many extracurricular activities that you can get into. You can meet new people. Um, and if you're from Utah, it's really close to home, like wherever you're from. So you're close enough that you don't have to be anxious about like not being able to spend a weekend or a holiday with your family. Um, but it's far enough away that you won't have your parents breathing down your back and being like, hey, how's everything going all the time constantly? Um, Snow is great. I really love what I know about it and what I've seen. Um, and I think that it's the school for you if you give it a chance.